Good morning, Tehmina Khan is here in TK Maths is fun. This is video number three on the topic percentages. You can see here in the previous videos, we have covered the concepts of pointers which I have written here. You can see here. These topics are known as FDP, fraction, decimal and percentage. So now today is the third video and it is talking about express the first quantity as a percentage of the second quantity. So let's see what does it mean. And this is very much used in the real life application. Right now it is only number mentioned. Later on we will convert it into word problem. So you need to understand how to handle these type of concepts. So express the first quantity. So this is my first quantity and this is my second quantity. Express the first quantity as a percentage of the second quantity. What does it mean? It means write it in the fraction form like this and then we have just learned when fraction is given to you and you have to change it into percentage you multiply by 100% now what is very important thing here you have to ensure that unit is same for both quantities first and second in this case it is dollar both so it is same no need to worry so I will simply just cancel the numbers Two sevens are fourteen, two twos are four, two ones are two, and then seven ones are seven, seven threes are twenty one. So I have one over three times hundred percent. I cannot cancel three by hundred, so I will simply do long division. One times hundred is hundred, divide by three. So now when you will do long division, all of you are good at this. Three threes are nine. 3 3 is a 9 so I have 33 whole 1 upon 3 percent let's see part B 33 centimeter is my first quantity and 3.96 meter is my second quantity now I will write first quantity in the numerator and second in the denominator but what is the problem here this is centimeter and this is meter so I need to change this meter into centimeter after that i will change it into percentage because this is already centimeter so we know one meter is 100 centimeter agreed so it will be equals to 396 centimeter or i can show it to you here also so that's why i will divide 33 by 396 and then i will multiply it by 100 percent okay so let's cancel it by the table of 3 3 ones are 3 3 ones are 3 3 ones are 3 3 threes are 9 3 twos are 6 again I'm telling you your tables need to be very strong otherwise these topics will be problem for you then it is what 11 ones are 11 11 ones are 11 2 will come here 11 twos are 22 so I am left with what 1 over 12 into 100 percent so 1 multiply by 100 is 100 100 divided by 12 percentage so I will do long division to find out the percentage so let me do long division here I will divide 100 by 12 now 12 ones are 12 so is not possible right because it is 10 here so I will keep reading and I will say when the number is less than 100. So suppose it is 12 times 8, 96, very close to 100. So I can say 12 times 8 is 96, remainder is 4. So I got 8 whole, 4 upon 12%. But this fraction I can cancel. I mean I can simplify. 4 ones are 4, 4 threes are 12. So 8 whole, 1 upon 3%. This is how you get the answer. Agreed? Let me solve one more and then the rest you will try. I have given the answer in black here. You can see here. So I am solving part C now. So again first quantity as a percentage of the second quantity. But the quantities are in different unit. So one day has how many hours? Yes you are right. 24 hours. So it means I will do 6 divided by 24 once I got this fraction 
I will change it into percentage. How? Multiplying it by 100%. Now I can cancel it. I hope you also know the table of 6. 6 ones are 6. 6 fours are 24. And then 4 is in the denominator. 100 is in the numerator. So you, do you know? 4 times 25 is 100. So I have 1 over 1 times 25 percent which means 25 percent because 25 ones are 25 and the denominator we do not mention one so i hope you understood how to express first quantity uh, as a percentage of the second quantity but make sure units are same so in the next video what do what we will see percentage of an amount we will see so we are leading towards where real life problems so this was a connection of it. So thank you very much for watching the video. Please press like and subscribe. And uh, you can give comments as well. How are you finding this learning? Take care. Allah Hafiz.